right. So, where are we again? Oh, okay. So we're still in the apartment room. Um, yeah. So we, oh, we have. Oh my gosh, what is going on here? Okay, so we have knocked out the police station. We've pretty much explored everywhere south of Lansdale Avenue. We are in the apartment complex and we are still on Lansdale Avenue and we're about, we're trying to get to that Centennial building, I guess is what it's called. And we just got to figure out how to get there. But we've got a lot of town to get through. So keep your eyes peeled. Help a brother out if we got puzzles and things to do. Yeah. Um, there was another outfit we could wear, but we decided that we liked these clothes best. Oh, no, 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 no. I want the fire axe. Hold on. There we go. That's the run button. I'm playing so many different games. I got to remember which button is the run, which one's the walk. Where are we going? What are we doing with our lives? It's a, it's a real challenge. Okay. Nothing too freaky or inconspicuous going on here. What's over here? <gasps> nice. See? This is what exploring is all about, guys. Explores. Let's see what's down this creepy hallway. Or alleyway, hallway, alleyway. Whatever. Come on. Straight to the noggin. There we go. Yeah. What's... All right. Let's see what this building's all about. Oh, okay. So there's like a basement. <laughs> Cause basements are not scary. What the hell? That, that is sketchy. What, where did we just walk into? Oh, there's a note here. Uh, Fender's Fine Art and Appraisals, October 3rd, Dear Mr. Rice. The Delayla painting in your collection needs to be in a public gallery, not the private home of an eccentric recluse who selfishly hoards such treasures for his sole enjoyment. I have tried repeatedly to get you to accept my generous offers to purchase the painting, but once again, you rebuff me, leaving me no choice but to take dr uh, drastic measures. It would be extremely unfortunate if certain details regarding your son's suicide were made public. Give me the painting, and I'll assure you that these allegations will never see the light of day. Refuse me and face the consequences. Sincerely, Melissa Matlin. Dang. Our collectors can be shady. And who's gonna... Why would you bring up someone's... Okay, that's not scary whatsoever. Oh, man. Uh, another Fender's Fine Art and Appraisals memo. How long is the map 
three by three grid, maybe I don't need the entire map to find the treasure. Who has the missing paintings? Cross check with art collector quarterly. Who's buying New England 19th century oils? Mr. Rice won't return calls. Mr. Barker refuses to sell. What do the symbols mean? Native American? Maybe Ang Ang Algonquian? Call Pat at Silent Hill Historic Society. Maybe he knows. Ravens? Death? Burial site? These look like different locations. Hmm. Oh, wait. What? He said that these look like different locations, but I'm trying to think like did we stumble on a map or something there's a painting there I don't see anything on the walls so we must be in like some kind of art gallery speaking of art yeah this is definitely some some kind of gallery of sorts. Mm. <laughs> nice to know that there's just, you know, hemoglobin. Just, you know, all over some fine art here. Can I open this? Is there any cash inside? Probably not. Sometimes there is. Who knows? Who knows? I don't see anything too, too crazy. Okay. Maybe down in the spooky basement. Oh, that's right. We got oil paintings like a couple weeks ago. If not, like, a week ago. So maybe those are the things that we're supposed to be looking for. What's over here? Doesn't look like it's a bunch of crates. Okay. Kind of on tense, because I don't, don't know if there's any monsters afoot. Okay. Guess he's not going to... I just... I see like wires and I think like, oh, that should probably homecoming has trained me that when one sees wires open like that, you probably need to do something with them. Like, gee, I don't know, spend like 10 minutes trying to figure out a stupid um, puzzle or some crap like that. I don't know. What's this? Oh, it's another painting. It's a nice little paintings. There's some that kind of remind me of, um, what is it? Uh, I don't want to get the artist wrong, but the one where like the faces look tortured and, and stuff like that. I'm trying to remember the name of them. I'm sure that somebody out there knows the artist that I'm talking about. Let's go check out this table. It's a piece of the map. Okay, so, well, let's just put these things in a. Oh, um, maybe that belongs there. I'm not trying to solve this, but maybe, maybe I am. I don't know. Maybe just like a little bit. Maybe just try solving a little bit of it. I've got quite a bit of items to put here, so. Maybe. I don't know. I'm just, just trying to figure it out. A 
let's see. Maybe right there? Seems like the most logical sense. I don't know where else this would belong because it looks like it would fit underneath the bottom one and I can't access the upper left hand corner. So, um, yeah. All right, well, we only got three more to go find, I guess. So that's kind of cool. Yep, so we have a mystery to solve there. And we still have one on the south side here to go figure out. Maybe, I don't want to like kind of backtrack. I think today's goal is to get to the tower, radio tower, but also to do as much as we can exploring in Silent Hill tonight. Okay, I was like, kind of thinking like, what if this bat monster thing respawns? I'm sure it will, but you know, I don't leave it a chance that this game's gonna try to debo me. With psych, you thought you were safe? You're never safe in Silent Hill. Not once, not never. I can't recall one time in any of the games where you ever feel safe. Okay, so... I also have to remember I have a timer on being out and about because the more it rains, the more those monsters come out to play which is like okay like whatever name of the game it's downpour what's this erudine johnson and she's eight years old dark brown hair was lost seen on april 11th around 2 15 while walking home from the hillside middle school she suffers from severe autism and is prone to wandering away from home she follows a fixed route home from her bus stop marked by a series of colored ribbons placed by her mother aradine has a strong aversion to the color blue and has been known to alter her route to avoid the color Anyone having information should contact the Silent Hill Police Department Missing Persons Hotline. Find the missing girl. We try to find everybody, apparently. Like, what is going on in this town? We're on the other side of the street here. Okay. So, Layman Avenue, I guess, is the only way that we can get from point A to point B on the side of the neighborhood. Okay, looks like there's a little squirrely side on that. What's this? Is this some place we can get? Oh, that's just stuff. Just stuff being stuff. Okay. It, it's some kind of bank? Looks like a really intense bank. I wish there were banks that actually looked like this. Oh, of course, there's got to be murder in the bank. Let's see what's over here. True life, though. Who would... I, I mean... I don't think I would... In real life, I would not be 
this brave to just wander into an abandoned bank and be like, la di da No, I'm just here to find health packs and things. Don't mind me by any chance. What's over here? See another radio. I would turn it on, but it's just gonna play music. Not like Silent Hill music, perchance. Like, that's what we've got going for ourselves right now. But what I'm getting at is, um, uh, definitely not any music of importance as far as Akira Yamaoka is concerned or Daniel Licht who composed the sonic world we're in today oh nice it's good to know there's a fire axe around here somewhere you know I'm trying to find like some kind of narrative in this building maybe I'm just missing it not sure hmm must be just another building not sure okay let's keep on exploring maybe there is something we uh oh there we go okay oh Poor birdie guy. I see skies of blue, clouds of white. Yeah, that is Murphy. That's definitely his arm right there. I don't know what this flashback is about, but oh, what's this? Today the news, riot at Ryle State Prison results in four fatalities. A full-scale riot at Ryle State Prison was finally brought under control last, uh, late last night after prison guards stormed the facility utilizing large quantities of tear gas, riot batons, and shotguns. Wrong word. It should be using large quantities of tear gas, riot batons, and shotguns because hopefully they were used for their intended purposes. As of this writing, four fatalities have been reported, all prisoners whose names are being withheld. Quote, after a tense standoff and a rather brutal physical confrontation, we were able to reestablish full control of the prison said Warden Glenn Milton. Rest assured, we will get to the bottom of this and find out what, and most importantly, who was the cause of this unfortunate disruption to normal prison operations. A number of guards were reported injured and the incident as well won seriously. Their names are also being withheld pending the investigation. Mm. That is, that is some tea. Oh, maybe we could get up there. That'd be fun. Let's go figure that out. Mm, we need to find one of those like hook things. My cat fist gig is uh getting the rips I'm already hearing it it's about that time in the in the evening where oh we're at the beginning again okay nice well kind of the beginning oh man There's hardly any, like, monsters about. Ain't that weird? We had, like, the one monster. Guess we could go up the rest of the... 
Oh, there's one. There's a dude. There we go. Maybe we could find one of those like hook fire, like um, hook stick things and maybe use it on that ladder. Oh, there's a subway here. Let's check this out. Are you a, are you a thing I can use? No, you're just a steak. Just a steak. My jalapeno on a steak. Oh, hello person. Um, hello? Person. Damn rain never lets up, does it? Man can catch his death out here. Of course, if you could spare something to eat, I could show you another way to get around town, keep your head dry. What do you say, friend? That's a fair trade, ain't it? Hmm. Okay. Gotta go find a vending machine for this random dude we just met. I don't leave anything to perchance. I think that maybe he's not a real person. Oh, we got another one of those lockers. We gotta figure out, team, how do we unlock those lockers? Cause I could just very easily go cheat and find out what the codes are. Cause the internet is a vast amount of information out there. And yet I also don't want to cheat, so. If you happen to know, or if you happen to find, if we happen to find a way to find out, let's go figure this whole thing out. Maybe get this guy something to eat. Speaking of eating, um, I remember there was this guy I used to work with and he would say um, throughout the day, he'd be like, Jeet? And I'd be like, Jeet? Jeet? No, I don't, I don't know what Jeet is. Like, not a normal word that I use um, in my vocabulary. I don't understand it. And he'd go, no, Jeet? Again, don't understand the words that are coming out of your mouth. And then one of my friends comes up to me and goes, no, he's asking if you eat. Have you eat yet? Like, did you eat? Oh, hey. Aaron Ashfield, apartment eight, two, nine, oh, nine, Whitmer Road. Hmm. Well, those numbers were circled for a reason. Let's go find out. What's over here? Oh, nice, another fire axe. What's in here? Oh, we got a keypad. Mm. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe? 827? Yo, the Naked Ramen, how you doing? Thanks for following. Hold on, let's get over to the business. Okay, so we found this like postcard with these like numbers circled and we need to, I guess because they're circled, they're probably a part of a code. So 827, 827, nice. I love it when things work out like that in video games. I don't know about you, but like, yeah, for days, for days. What's over here? What's this? 
This looks like one of those weird paintings. We got two more paintings to get. What? Yo, we might have a side quest. Yes. Well, it's my first time in like a really long time playing Downpour. And the name of the game is to get all the side quests done. As well as, which has never been done. I've never done that. As well as just get this we've done everything from silent hill to silent hill downpour we've we've hit every single silent hill game that i have in my collection i got almost all the trophies but two of them what which ones like which ones do you think are missing which ones do you think were the hardest because we're still in we just made it yeah i i have i used to have my sister actually has a majority of the collection from early 2000 and that means like og silent hill 2 um origins on playstation and um shattered memories on the wii um now those two games I have not played because I kind of need to find like an emulator or some backdoor way of playing those games. But as far as my collection, we played the OG Silent Hill 2, 3, um, unfortunately the remastered version. And then we went back over to set. What is he looking at? He is like intensely looking at something over here. Murphy, what are you doing, bro? Is it over here? Is this a thing? What? What are you looking at? Is there? I. It looks like trash. It's trash. Okay, so. Yeah, we did uh, Silent Hill 4 on the PlayStation 2, and then we did Homecoming not too long ago, and now we're in Downpour. I might have to dig out the PS3 and dust it off, but I need to rebuy Downpour. Oh man, if you had the PS3 and had the um, PT game on it, do not, under any circumstances, re like download any software anything that would connect your ps4 or 3 to um the playstation network because playstation network will forcibly remove uh silent hill pt um i don't know why yeah, don't do it. Don't, do not. If you love playing PT, do not plug it into network because PlayStation will forcibly remove your game. Um, it happened to my friend Travis, who got me hooked on Silent Hill. So um, I was really sad about that because I got to play that once and maybe... Oh yeah, we're still looking for food for the homeless guy. We need to find some way to, maybe a vending machine. But yeah, if you want anything sacred, do not plug in your old consoles into network for any reason at all. Oh, really? Really, I did not know that. I didn't know that the... You know, I would have imagined that despite Konami being the company that we lovingly hate and yet also adore, that somebody who owns Downpour... What's this? Oh. Sweetie, mommy has made a new path for you to follow home. Remember the rules. Yellow ribbon, turn left. Red ribbon, turn right. I know you sometimes get confused, so just be a big girl and look for mommy's ribbons and you'll be fine. Whatever you do, don't break the rules. Mommy will be waiting for you at home. Hugs and kisses, mommy. 
Oh, this is for the autistic girl. Um, okay, we'll get there. We're still trying to find at the games on PSP as well. So many of these games love Silent Hill as a kid. Father got a PS1 for that game. I know, right? Like, I, um, I think it was like 2007. My friend Travis and I went halvesies on a copy of Silent Hill, uh, the original PS game. And then we did not realize that a PlayStation 2 memory card is incompatible with um, PlayStation games. Who knew? Oh, it's starting to rain. Hold on. We got to, you know, we have like, we have an art piece we can just dump off. And then by the time we're done with that, we can... Hopefully the rain will. Yeah, I still got my PS3, PS1 memory cards, a PS2 memory cards. I have a PS1 and PS2 memory card as well. And it's just strictly for PlayStation and Crash Bandicoot game. And um, freaking, uh, we left the PlayStation 2 running all night. So that way we could um, go get a memory card at the game store the next day. I don't think that's right. What do I feel like this is wrong? Did I screw? I think I screwed this up. Nope. Hold on. I think part of this is right. Part of this is wrong. Anyway, we'll figure it out. Uh, we, we overheated the PlayStation 2. The... Uh, and still going strong till this day. The amount of DVDs I watch. I know. Oh my gosh. Um, I still have some DVDs, and I was just lucky enough to get or find a uh, torrent back in the day. Oh, I'm incriminating myself. I did not pirate or steal anything ever in my life. Um, but somehow. I got an acquired Tenchi Muyo OVAs in the um, universe and Tokyo and all the classic. The OVAs, OG, OVA. And then, yeah, Yu Yu Hakusho was great. And here's the thing, I was on deployment and I had, you know, Tsunami, they, I think they did like a good job of trying to keep some games, uh, sorry, some TV shows like syndicated and things, but I don't remember them playing the end of Yu Yu Hakusho or like, doing all the tournaments. Tenshi Tokyo, it was... It was an experience. That's all I can say about it. It's definitely campy. But finding out how Yu Yu Hakusho ends was kind of a... Well, they just wrapped that up fairly easy. Like, you know, not, not the ending I wanted, but it was the ending I got. And I'm still a bit... I, what's W... Oh, Sledgehammer. Nice. I can't get in there. Hmm. Okay, maybe the game still is... We're still trying to find... Yeah, I, I like it. Don't get me wrong. I do like it. Um, it, It's one of the... It's one of those endings that's like, eh, it's an ending, but, like, I felt like the last tournament kind of, like, got, I guess, like, devoed, like, pretty easily into, like, well, we gotta, like, wrap this up. We got, like, three more episodes, and the stakes are too high, so let's just, like, let's just figure it out. Let's just make an ending happen, you know? And I think that's what they did, you know? E effectively. Um, you know, there was a lot of, like, oh, no, like, you know, his teacher dies, or, you know, his creature flying penguin bird thing, uh, is not feeling too good, and it was just, like, a weird, not, like, weird, but... You know, I, I didn't know, like, what, at the end of it all, was the important part, aside from winning the tournament, you know? So, it was weird. We're still trying to find a stupid, um, vending machine. We gotta find the vending machine for the stupid homeless guy. I mean, you know, they didn't give me a name, so I don't know what's... I'm looking around, trying to find this thing. Hmm. Maybe it's on the other side of the map. That could be a possibility. It could be anywhere. Who knows? We'll just go back this direction. <gasps> what is this? Nice. Okay. Awesome. See, if we just like backtrack a little bit, we would have found it. We did. I'm gonna go to the homeless guy and give him some candy. Probably not the food he was wanting, but the food he got. I just can't be choosers. But yeah, PlayStation 2. For some reason, I have a thin one and I have a 
that, that. the bigger one that like I think it was like first gen I think that was kind of the beginning of like first gen second gen consoles specifically with the um oh that door did just do a thing give him the candy bar sorry it's not much but you're welcome to it you got a map of the town let me show you something Oh, okay. So we kind of have the, this... Oh. There's a whole other side of the town we gotta get to. Pleasant River. Uh, Chastain Heights. Hillside. Well, we were just at Hillside, so... Okay. See that? There's tunnels all over Silent Hill, connecting one part of town to the other. You just gotta think like a rat, see? A rat's vermin. But he knows how to survive. How to stay out of the rain. You think like a rat kid and you'll be fine. Just like old Homer. Oh, his name's Homer. I tell you what. It gets awful cold most nights. If you found me a coat to keep warm, I could show you some more shortcuts to keep you dry. You just come back here and find me. Okay, Homer. First things first. Let's go... Down, uh, do you think, you know what? Let's go back to the bank. Now that we've got this side quest done, let's go to the bank and see what else we need to do there. Cause we just kind of like explored a little bit, but I don't know what exactly we were supposed to do there. And there's also that, um, that, uh, ladder thing that we need to pull down and I feel like what is he looking at half the time like his head turns and I don't know why I feel like there should be a reason okay yeah let's get back into the let's get Going through these doors. Check this all out because we already have before. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, there's a downstairs. Okay. Uh, uh my memory is like really hazy on this, so. best we can do it's going yeah cuz that photo does not look like Alessa Gillespie at all maybe there's a painting around here I don't know I'm trying to think like how many other places could there we have like two more paintings to go find so it's got to be somewhere around here This looks sketchy as all get out. Like, what? I just, I feel like the alarm's gonna go off and I don't know why. Should I? Oh, they're glowing. I can hit any one of these. Wait a minute. Let's see if there's like an alarm system and see if there's like any way of turning that. It's got to be in this room. There's no way. I feel like this game gassed me up for this moment. What's this? Who are you? Who's your mom? Where did you come from? Where do you live? It looks like an alarm system. And yet I don't see anything else. 
that screams, hey, press this button to turn off the alarm. There's like cam um, televisions, I suppose, for cameras. It's a bank. There's. <sighs> okay. I'm gonna be a really big thief and go for the bigger treasure. An alarm, of course. How could I be so stupid? I knew it. I knew it, Mikey. Of course. Wait, do I have to run down there and get the treasure or the gold or whatever's down here? Oh my gosh. What is... Come on in. Let's go. Boom. Okay. All right. Maybe this is the point, like some kind of like time trial of running and doing like how many bad guys can you kill in one sitting no 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 thank god for that door come on not the first machine I would or guy I would go after, but let's go over here, kill this guy. There we go. Come back over here, get her. There we go. I don't, I'm panicking this whole thing. Oh my gosh. Like my hands are sweating because I'm just like, what? is the next part no 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 wait hold on pick that up come on battle axe i'm so glad they gave me a gun because we haven't had a gun since the um stupid uh park place or the devil's pit that's what it was <laughs> Knock this guy out. Okay. And then this guy. I feel like I'm doing pretty good. Just gotta backtrack a little. I did not even think about that. There was a fellow who was um, playing along with me or watching along with me. And we, he was like telling me that like when this moment, when that moment, that bridge moment happened, he was like, I think I screwed up. I need to go back. I need to rethink what I'm doing here. How many, how many, how many? Okay. Oh, oh I, this guy does not come with a lock feature at all. Come on. Ugh. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I gotta go back over here and kill these ones. Okay, and then this one. There we go. And then this one. Oh. 
Yo! We just got paid. Bro! Gold! Oh, that's not the button I wanted. <laughs> wow! Okay. All right. Well, that was that. I'm kind of damaged. I should probably fix that a little. Tons of stuff. Yeah. Okay. Um. Uh, we'll we'll patch up because Boyo Boyo did some work. Was that everything for this place? Hold on. There was a question mark on this spot. Okay, so there's... There's a question mark up there, but I thought we did that. And then there's that ladder there. We still need to find like a hook thing for it. That one on the left is the painting thing. And then I don't know what the bottom one is, but we ran into like a house with some kind of crying ghost. I don't know, but. So the next mystery. Oh, in the one right there, that's the, that's the find the missing girl one so we need to go find one of those sticks things there's like fishing hook ones or something we gotta find one of those things to keep the eye peeled out of everybody oh no no it's a key it's this way this way okay so hold on what it feels like i should be able to jump through this i don't know why but you know like some silent hill free jump through a window to get somewhere it's kind of what i'm feeling that it was Oh, stick. He wants it. He wants that. That's, that's the item he's been looking at. Yeah, like, one of these stick things is just going to be in the, like, most random spot in the whole town. We also have this mystery up here that, for some reason, did not clear. I thought we cleared it, for some reason. Keep an eyes peeled for... Irax. It's okay. We, we got one. We're good. Unless we're supposed to be in here somewhere, for some reason. I don't know why. Like, mash, 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 mash. No? Okay. What? I feel like I'm missing like a really huge like point to being here in this space. Because this is one of the mystery spots, but I don't know what the mystery is, Scooby. I don't I wish I had a clue. But I don't have a clue. Unless if it's something Is it this? No. It's just like one of those like weird barrier things. Hmm. What's the point? What is the point? I hit the code. I did the thing. No, I guess I'll just trade battle axes. Why not? Hmm. Okay. Back to the original hunt here. We're trying to find another guy to go just break down. I noticed that one of them had like a shake or something. And I don't agree with this. I don't appreciate the kind of sorta of inmate people, monster things, having shakes. Because how dare. Mm. Looking for something that we can pull down a ladder with. It could be anything. It could be anywhere. Who knows? That's a steel pipe. Okay. Guess we'll just go in here. Do things. The evil that we do do. Hm. I said do do. Oh! Sweet! Alright. Right on, team. Let's go figure out what that other mystery thing is. The the thing from the um, ladder. Pull-down ladder. Oh, I love it when things work out like this. Let's see. You have to zigzag this way. Go through this direction. And then it should be on this side. It's not like Ashfield. What is? We're in Silent Hill 4 territory. Ashfield Heights? I think was the name of it. Yeah, here's the... 
There we go. Let's see what's up the ladder. Windows. Great. Awesome. Hmm. I wish they redid downpour without the long loading times. I know me too. Seriously, even if it's like downloaded for any particular reason, is there something I supposed to do here? Maybe. snap yo oh really they had like two details to put here everybody a stupid ceiling fan and a table and maybe oh you know what I'm shook about this. Look at this. It's room 302, guys. Gals, everybody, dudes and dudettes. Yo, can I access this? No. Damn. It'd be so cool if this was like a storage compartment for, for items or something. But like, hey, they kind of nailed this place. The only thing they're missing is like the table ceiling fan the uh dresser side table wow see this is like the room 302 we all wanted and never got does this imply that the good ending was an ending because if the bad ending was a thing the the locks are still there Whoa, wait a minute. The shoes. Oh my god, when the shoes move, that was that. <gasps> wait a minute. They put a door here. Wait a second. This is to the bathroom. Oh, we can only access this one room? Come on, damn poor. We could have at least gotten the bathroom and the bedroom. Come on. That's weird that they put a door at the end of the hallway. That is so cool. Wait, is this gun better than my other gun? It's a Colt. What's this? Oh, I got... I guess the Colt is the only thing we could have. This is so cool. Oh, paintings are missing. Wait, can I look into the other room? Nope. Can't go see Eileen's room. The paintings are like... This is so, so cool. Wow. I am fanboying right now. Wow. That was so cool. Right on. Nod to Silent Hill 4. I'm about this life. Okay. Um. I don't have any more paintings. I've tried keeping an eye out for those paintings. We could go down to the heights. And then see if, um... I do not have the battle axe for that fight. I'm not about to fight that guy. That's not about to happen. Um... You can follow me until I disappear. I don't care. Uh -huh. Let's go check out the mystery in the south side of... I guess we're in Asheville Heights. I can't think of anywhere else in Silent Hill that we're at. Hmm. I remember playing this game the first time around, and I just went through for the story. I did not do any of this. I did. I do remember doing the the Homer homeless guy thing, um, but I don't remember. <coughs> okay, this um this locker here, it's like a 
I want the thing. I'm asking, like, you, the viewers, we need to figure out what... Wait, am I in the... Okay. Um, what are those locks? Because I did not access those um, when I first played. And I'm curious what they are and how to access them. Because... Oh, nice. Check that out. Well, this will definitely knock out some runtime. Pretty darn cool. Cheers. We've kind of been here before. Wow, room 302. What a treat. What a treat. Let's see. Okay. Mm I like that we have enough health to pretty much kill with. Which is pretty fortunate for us. Who's here? Oh, this guy. Jeez. Not a strong item. That that was worth like one bad guy. <gasps> okay, where's that haunted house thing? I think it's over here. Okay, this was the whole point. We gotta get in here and figure out what to do in this stream has turned into. How to access or fix or do something with these mysteries. I'm hearing crying, so like as spooky as this is. <laughs> it's locked, right? We got to find a key and I don't know. Where to access? Oh, you're saying, oh yeah, and I'm like, oh yeah, like, what do we do? What do we? Oh, okay. So, um, now there's like a high pitch squeal going on. We gotta find some kind of key. That door is locked, but I don't know what or why. Let's see. Anything here? I think I remember how to do that, but I'm not sure. And I don't want to spoil. Of course, because, you know, survival, horror. It's not about the spoils. But I do ask for class participation. <laughs> Um, thanks. I appreciate it. I do this for you. I really, really do. And it's a glutton for punishment, really. Especially, oh my gosh, the montage that I put together at the beginning of the stream. Hey, Madele uh, Maid Link, how's it going? Welcome to the pate. Wait, <gasps> it opened? What's going on? Where's the, the laughing's gone or the crying? What is going on here? What's, I am so on nines. Where have you been? Yeah, I I work wonky hours, so everyone's lucky enough to get my replies back throughout the day. Um, it's not nefarious in any way. I am a night owl, so I don't see anything creepy happening. That's off-putting. That light glistening was this a bait and switch cuz I swear to God if there's nothing going on here in this house 
You're nervous. I'm on tens right now. I am freaking the frick out. Because there's no more crying. And now I'm like shadow playing with myself because I don't know what to expect and everything in darkness is freaking me out. What is going on? What is going on? Is that it? What? I'm so like confused. What was the point? Oh my glob. What if there was no point? What if all that crying was for like a really bad television? Is there anything? What is... I don't see anything of value in here. I'm shook. This was like scare for what? Oh my gosh. I hate how dark this area is, but I also kind of like it because glutton for punishment. Uh, what's this? Got ammo. What was that? What am I swinging at? Oh, Shiza! Oh! What is this? It's a mannequin? Oh. Oh. Okay, everyone. Um. Confession. I have a fear of mannequins. And this game just reinforce that fear in a very positive way. Hold on. We still have a mystery here. We don't, what? I feel like it's still in here. Whatever it was that we were supposed to do. There's more? In here? No. There's more mannequins around here? I mean... Oh, not the quest. Okay. <sighs> okay. Because... I'm telling you, like, I'm, I'm shaking right now. Like... <laughs> All that's got me on nines right now. Oh my gosh. That was crazy. Okay. Um Don't know about y'all, but I think we're good in this how there's nothing. I don't think there's anything else. I'm trying to figure out. I might have done it. Might be because of the vault. Oh, yeah, this thing here. Which again, I don't know the exactitude of like how does one find the numbers for those vaults, but um, I am aware that there's at least two here. And at the beginning of town, where we've. Cause it's been so much for us. 
just get back into the hillside. Subway. You know, it kind of makes sense that, like, this, um, side of town has the subways kind of, like, in Silent Hill 4. So, that's, that's pretty freaking cool. I'm about that life. Like, a little nods to Silent Hill 4. Still shaking, by the way. Because, mannequins. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I am not, not about it. Not once, not never, and you may be asking yourself, Mr. Sean, how does one buy clothes or, you know, navigate supermarkets and stores and things like that without dealing with mannequins? I shall tell you, I don't buy my clothes or, you know, go to such places that have mannequins. And if there are mannequins, then I stay exactly one person lengthwise away from the mannequins because, mm -mm. nope, not once, not never. Some of these, like, are not disappearing, like room 302 and the other one's just north of me. So, um... We're gonna knock this witch out. Oh! There we go. Hopefully, there's no other monsters around. I'm really liking this sledgehammer. Not as agile as the axe is. Stranger danger. Bro. Do you know what town we're in? I know that the main goal here, and the main goal tonight, was to get to the tower. Which, our faithful axe is still here. Oh, this game is awesome. Okay. I like that when we leave things, they stay there. Oh, I got another axe there. Got a stone. A rake. Hmm. Like all survival horror and naked ramen. Um, gotta, gotta explore. Because that's the heart and soul of survival horror. Leaving no stone unturned. I have been noticing these things. These candles and things. And they're always next to like dirt. And I don't know why. So yeah. Um... Oh, so you remember why. But of course, you've played this probably a lot more in depth than I have, so. Oh, okay. Can't go that way. Can, can I go this way? No? Hmm. Okay. I don't remember... I really don't remember a whole lot of this. So it's pretty much like walking new. To full 100% completion, bro. Nice, yeah, the secret endings. That was me over a decade ago. Oh, red ribbon, we're not supposed to go this way. Huh. He is not looking too good. Poor Murphy. I think this is the clock tower place. Baker Street? Yeah. All right. Well, we're going to load into this area these are my parole papers who is doing this what do you want from me what do you want from me what do you want from me hey Murphy I got your paperwork here take a look Hey, Murphy, remember, this is a limited time offer, my friend. I'll let you know. What's up, Officer Coleridge? What was that about? Mm, uh, nothing. Hey, don't bullshit a bullshitter. Sewell's bad news, Murph. He doesn't do anyone favors. What are you in for with him? It's nothing. It's... Don't worry about it. For your sake, I hope so. 
I don't want to get your hopes up, kid, but the parole board's looking pretty closely at your case. Don't In a screw good this way? up now. Not after all I've done to get you out of here. Don't worry, Officer Coleridge. I, I got it all under control. Just some unfinished business to take care of. That cop back there? What the hell are you doing in here anyway, Murphy? You're you're not like these guys. I told you, sir. It, car theft, resisting and evading, and uh, yeah. You stole a police cruiser and ran him on a ten-hour chase down the eastern seaboard. What makes a guy with no priors and a clean sight do something that stupid? I think you at least owe me the truth. Maybe I just needed to escape from the world for a while. Yeah, well, you just steer clear of Sewell and do your homework, right? You got it, Chief.